tribal resolution of the Muskogee Creek Nation authorizing the principal chief to execute an order, form, and master services agreement. Collectively, the agreement with Cision U.S. Inc. Sponsor for this is Representative Travis Scott. Motion to adopt. Representative Scott makes a motion to adopt. Seconded <laughs> by Representative Huff. Uh, Representative Jones, excuse me. <laughs> Did anybody here have any? Do you have any questions? Any questions from the committee? Council on the floor. Good. All right, roll call vote. Travis Scott? Yes. 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 Four in favor, zero against. The legislation passes. Next item on the agenda, TR 20-037, a tribal resolution of the Muskogee Creek Nation, amending TR 18-099, a tribal resolution of the Muskogee Creek Nation, creating a Muskogee Business Assessment Committee, as amended by TR, dash, or excuse me, TR 18-135, and TR 19-070. Sponsored, Representative Travis Scott. Motion to adopt. Motion to adopt. Second. Seconded by Representative Huff. Do you have anybody for discussion? Chair. <coughs> Sir. We, uh, we had to correct the date on line 21 on page 2. Uh, that was to further the uh, final report of the Business Assessment Committee due to the audit of one fire, which is uh, going to be complete, uh, hopefully. And that way they can get these information to the, to uh, Sovereign, to the, to the company that they are, uh, are, are studying. And that was the reason for the date. Great. Question. Do you know when the audit will be finished? Right. In its totality, probably by the end of March. We are, and that's one of the things I'm going to present today. We have all the entries made, everything's done, and the numbers are done at this point. But there's a few little loose ends to tie up, and I'll mention those in our, uh, in our discussion. But he should have everything, Joel said he would have everything signed off on by the end of the month. At the latest. <coughs>
change the language to read, there shall be an ex officio member selected by the Business, Finance, and Justice Committee to serve as a, a liaison between the board and the National Council. The ex officio member may participate in discussions at the board meeting, but shall not make motions or votes. So I have a second. Second. Second and Representative Freeman. Go follow. Are there any discussion on the amendment? Excuse me. Any discussion on the amendment? Yes. Adam Jones? Yes. Travis Scott? Yes. Patrick Freeman? Yes. <coughs> Four in favor and zero against. Four in favor and zero against. The amendment passes. Back to the main motion. As amended. Any discussion? Any discussion on the main motion? Yes, sir. Representative Jennings. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. The selection it says by the BFJ committee, but can that be any council member or does it have to be a BFJ committee member? A member of the BFJ committee. It didn't state that that's what I'm saying. So that means we can amend that. We can amend that and put it in there. Thank you. Thank you. Now we'll get another motion. Yeah. Well, maybe if, can we just add a member of that, Alicia? We've done it. Yeah, I can add language. Okay, we'll change the language in the amendment that we just passed. Any more discussion? All right. Roll call vote. Yes. Adam Jones? Yes. Charles Scott? Yes. Patrick Freeman? Yes. Attorney Hatton, one favor, zero against. One favor, zero against. That legislation passes. Bring us down to other business.
Representative Huff makes a motion to go into the executive session. <coughs>